everyone, it's Professor Hall, and the census roster has been posted, and everybody is doing such a good job, and we have such excellent participation in this class. I stopped grading your poetry submissions because I was giving so many zeros because students are submitting work without their name, course information, assignment date, and word count. And I cannot assign a grade to any document that doesn't have a name on it. I'm sure you can understand that because otherwise I'm giving a grade to something that who knows who that was submitted by. So once again, there is information in the modules about word count. There's more information on why you need to submit a word count. And I want to remind you also that the syllabus shows you where you need to put your name on a document. Let's look at that together. On anything that is an essay, I need to make sure that I have my name, English, the section, whatever the title of that exercise is, the date, and the word count. For shorter exercises, it's all right just to put a final word count, but remember that if it's anything that included several drafts like an essay, there needs to be a count for the drafts as well as the final count. Every assignment, no matter what it is, needs to have a title. Even if it's a text assignment, it still needs to have course information and a title. Otherwise, that is entered automatically in Canvas as a zero. Today is Monday, September the 10th, and you have until Wednesday, September the 13th, to go back into those OWL assignments that you have submitted and resubmit those with your name, course information, assignment, date, and word count. Then I will go back in and I will grade that assignment. The other work that you've turned in recently will be graded within the next seven days. If you submitted any of that work and did not include your name and course information and word count, this would be a good time to go back in and change that as well. If you have trouble resubmitting any work, you shouldn't have any trouble as long as a grade has not been assigned to it. And even if it has, you should be able to resubmit work. If you have any problems with that, that would be a tech support issue and you would need to contact the help desk for that. If you do contact the help desk, be sure and take down the name of the person you speak to at the help desk. And once again, if you go to the modules and you look at the Start Here module, you'll find information about submitting a PDF document and including a word count. Of course, you will not submit a PDF assignment if this is a text assignment. Then, as you know, you will follow those prompts for submitting a text. You will still need to include your name, course information, and word count. Otherwise, you will receive a zero or deducted points, and we don't want to see that. You're working so hard, and you have such great things to say. Your poems were just beautiful, and I don't want to have to not give you credit or take points off because you didn't put your name on there. So let's make sure that we get back on track with that, okay? All right, so since this has been reported, we're off on a great track. We just have got to do a better job with getting our names on information so that uh, you don't lose those valuable points. You're an awfully great class. I'm really enjoying this, but let's make sure that everybody gets uh, things submitted properly. Okay, that concludes this little tutorial.